Meghan Markle, 41, was troubled by the dark feelings she harbored towards socialite turn entrepreneur Paris Hilton, and ultimately ended up inviting her on her Archetypes podcast to apologize to her. In a special episode called Breaking Down the Bimbo, she admitted to resenting Paris Barbie doll persona as she felt she didn't grow up pretty herself, and the pair then had a spirited debate. I'm really sorry that I judged you, Meghan told her former rival, who in turn opened up about the trauma she suffered in her school days. Because my whole sense of self-confidence was wrapped up in being the smart one and not the pretty one, I found the way to project all of my judgment and envy, onto, Paris, she explained on the podcast, adding she hadn't understood why the heiress wanted to act stupid. Envy can be a very dangerous thing, as can judgment. I was ashamed to admit that I harbored either of those feelings, so I talked to her," Meghan continued. Paris' great-grandfather Conrad was famous for founding the Hilton Hotel brand, while Paris later launched herself on the Los Angeles party scene as a socialite and celebrity. She later bragged that she had invented the trend of getting paid to party after she discovered she could command large sums of money for publicizing events simply by appearing at them. However, she attracted negative comments after critics argued that she was famous merely for being famous and nothing more. The heiress entered modeling aged 19 after signing up with Donald Trump's agency and later went on to dabble in acting, singing and entrepreneurship. She even fronted her own TV series, The Simple Life, with her best friend Nicole Richie appearing in it as her mischievous sidekick. However, there was a dark side to her story, which Meghan touched on during the podcast, telling the world, while she admits she played into this dumb, and, blonde persona, that she, in part, co-created with the media, she also revealed years of trauma. The same year that Paris debuted as a model, she made a sex tape with boyfriend Rick Solomon, which ended up all over the internet, bearing the name One Night in Paris. Besides that, she also revealed she was traumatized by her experience of attending a strict correctional boarding school in Utah as a teen. Lamenting that she felt it had taken away her childhood, she added, The only thing that kept me going in there was just thinking about who I wanted to be and what I wanted to become when I got out of there. I just promised myself. I'm going to work so hard and become so successful that no one will ever be able to control me ever again. Her efforts paid off, as she has now become a household name, with her perfume line alone having earned her billions of dollars. Meanwhile, Meghan apologized for judging her based on her looks and persona, explaining, I didn't grow up pretty. Paris, who is now 41 like Meghan, discussed with her the prospect of having a daughter of her own. I don't want her to think it's cool to pretend to be a dumb blonde or dumb herself down for society, she told the Duchess. Meghan's chat with Paris took place for the latest episode in her podcast series, Archetypes. She has explained her controversial Spotify series as a way to dissect, explore and subvert the labels that try to hold women back. 